Hello and welcome to our channel. Today we are back at the Mississippi Aquarium. We thought we would do some things that we uh, missed out on last time just because it had just opened. Yeah, and so, so they, we're gonna... they've added some new stuff since mm -hmm. we've been gone. Yeah, so uh, dolphin experience. Cool. Uh, maybe the otters will be out. We don't know. We're going to eat at the Pelican Point Cafe. And sort of the capstone of our trip will be Sea Trek. Mm -hmm. uh, so that should be fun. Now it's just going to be me because... Yep. Liz is pregnant with our son, so she's she's unable to uh, to do that today. But but I'll hop in uh, a wetsuit and put the helmet on and, and see how that is. So, all right, let's go. understanding of dolphins and their amazing capabilities. Much of what we know about marine mammal health care, reproduction, and intelligence has been learned through scientific studies at zoos and aquariums with trained animals and directly benefits marine mammals out in the ocean. I want to thank you guys all so much for coming out and joining us here at Mississippi Aquarium. I want to invite you to hang out and watch the rest of our training session here. We're also going to be coming out and chatting with you guys once the session is over. Have a great rest of your day here at Mississippi Aquarium. Bye, everyone. This the show was really fun. I thought yeah. that was cool. It's neat to show the, uh, the positive reinforcement that they have and all the different mm -hmm. tricks that they can do and just how smart they are. It's neat to see them playing with the balls and all that. I just wish there was a little shade up here. Mm -hmm. uh, that yeah, would be, that'd there be needs good. to be like there is downstairs, seating, but but uh, seating and shade. Yeah, seating would be nice. Yeah, but uh, yeah, it's it's really cool. Let's see, let's see this. All right, so now we're gonna head over to Pelican Point and get some lunch. To see how the food is here.
All right, so what we got was the crispy chicken sandwich. That looks really good. Maybe open that one up. So I think it has it a like. buffalo oh, aioli yeah. and some kind of slaw. Ooh, yummy. And then these are some Mississippi River fries. Mm -hmm. And then I got the chef special, which is the Gulf shrimp wrap with some chips. Should be good, but say it is. Look at that shrimp. What are these? Nachos. Nachos. Ooh. They look great. It's got like beans and looks like bean salsa. More stuff on it. Yeah. Give it a try. Is it good? Yeah. So these nachos are really nice, very creamy. This cheese is almost the consistency of like a beer cheese. It's got some red beans in there and it looks like cilantro, sour cream, onions, really good. So we're actually going to trade off a little bit with the uh, with the meal. She's gonna take half and I take half. Mm -hmm. That way we can try them thoroughly. Yep. So this wrap is really good. Uh, the sauce okay. is kind of like, um, almost like a Dijon, like a honey mm -hmm. Dijon. It's very yeah. sweet and uh, it is nicely balanced with the shrimp. These are sort of uh, some house-made style chips, and they're good. They're they're not uh, they're not as heavily seasoned as you might think by the mm -hmm. color, uh, but they're uh, they're tasty. All right, so how's the crispy chicken sandwich? It's good. I just they forgot my tomato. Oh, I don't know what okay. it is, but please forgive you know me. You know, tomatoes. <laughs> tomato, tomato. So this chicken sandwich is very nice too. Um, the, the breading is nice and crispy. The sauce, I think, is the same thing that's on the fries. And it's good. It yeah. works works really well. It, it is a it's good a chicken sandwich. Yeah. It's a buffalo aioli. Okay. At least on the sandwich, it is. Okay. All right. So, how's your burger? Delicious. Delicious. Yeah, you both got this. Delicious. Yeah. I I like the fries too. It's almost like a sweet barbecue sauce. Yeah. yeah. Look how much meat is in there. Wow. That's good. Very generous. Mm -hmm. All right. So this is the kids' burger. It looks really good some sort of steak fries this is a hot dog very yummy these are these are good sized meals here man holy cow what is that soft pretzel. soft pretzel it's huge that's like as big around as a football and then uh we got a salad here this salad looks really good hey what that's a side salad side salad not a fried salad all right so we're gonna try this pretzel here is that nice mm -hmm. It has like a bit of a snap before it's soft on the inside. Mm -hmm. That's really good. Very buttery. The salt, I feel like it's pretty balanced too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a good pretzel. Yeah. And by the way, if you guys didn't know, Bark's Root Beer was invented just a few miles away in Biloxi, Mississippi. Now, in case you haven't seen the other video that we did, which I'll link up, uh, they don't let you have your bottle caps. They don't want the animals consuming them. That would be a bad thing. So this cookie was $3, but it's pretty good size. Oh, look. This is like the... Uh, <laughs> look, the name is on oh, the sticker. Great. It's hard to remember. The Triple Chocolate Salted Caramel Cookie. Now, Fisher Cookie of Mississippi Aquarium. Ooh. Pretty good. Oh my gosh. Glory. Maybe I'll take more than half of this. Hmm. <laughs> it looks like it maybe has white chocolate. Yeah. Mm. What do you think? It looks good. It's soft too. Yep. Yeah. It's what the baby wants. So it's very soft, um, pretty uniform in its consistency um, as far as like the cookie base, but uh, very good. I like the balance of the salted caramel with the chocolate. That's good. That, that is a nice official cookie to have. This is milk. Oh. But that's always Ma the case. <laughs> Not the cookies. That's true. Mm -hmm. Something to be noticed, uh, they don't always have the umbrellas out here, so so shade's a, a bit limited. We just kind of got under these palm trees. <laughs> actually, the first time we came, they had the umbrellas, so I don't know yeah. why they took them out. Because it was uh, actually really helpful. Maybe it just depends on the weather. Are right, we going to check to see if the otters are here. Check them out. There he is. How oh, cool. The otters. Oh, he just crawled up in his log. That's cool. <laughs> there he is! <laughs> Our otter's adorable. So cute. Yeah. They are. Oh, well. Wait, he's coming out. He's coming out. He's in <gasps>
So over there you can see the helmets for the sea truck. The floor is not slick in this roll tank area this time, so that's great. A lot of fun. It's cool coming here with kids too. Oh yeah. That was our second trip to the Mississippi Aquarium. We had a really good time. Uh, unfortunately, we didn't get to do the sea trek uh, because they, they notified us whenever we went up to get tickets that they needed, they needed 24, 24 hours in notice. advance. Yeah, and we did not do that. So you should be sure to do that if you uh, if you want to go on that sea trek. Um, also, um, if you want to do it, you have to bring your own swimsuit mm -hmm. and towel. Also, if well. um, you get a discount also if you're a member. Right, yeah. Aquarium, so. In fact, you, you get a discount on just about everything mm -hmm. if you remember. So yeah, gift shops. Something food. to think about. Yeah. Overall, though, it was great. It was neat seeing the otters and the dolphins. Yeah, and all there that were stuff. some more animals out than um, the first time, so the dolphins mm -hmm. were really cool. Yeah, and the food was really good. We enjoyed it. So, yeah. so with that, uh, I guess we'll catch you guys later. All right. Thanks so much for watching. Bye. Right here. There she is. <laughs> I was like, I was like,